Hey folks, today is February 25th. It's currently 946. So as you can see, I am running late. They had, I believe, one trade this morning. That was a uh, winner. So, so far we have one call in the room. And we'll continue watching. They had a uh, short call. So hopefully we'll get another uh, opportunity to jump in here. They usually trade for at least uh, 30 minutes to an hour. So hopefully we'll get another couple trades that I can catch for you guys. Let me see what news came out. Hold on. I'll be back with you guys momentarily. I want to check a Forex factory. All right. Looking at Forex factory, I don't really see anything that would have caused that huge push down here. Unemployment claims was at 830, but we're now at 947. As you can see, there's been a pretty heavy push down. So I'm not sure what caused this, but it is um, still continuing to push down. So we'll see what happens here. And I can also show you guys while we're waiting for the vendor to uh, take a trade. What's the 60 minute chart shows ranging trend since yesterday's huge lift. I made 2K on yesterday's ride up. Nice. All right. One moment, folks. Let me pull this other uh, side up. All right, I want to take a look at FX Signals Live. Let's go ahead and click on Traders so we can take a look and see what they've been doing here. This is the Trade Copier service. Right now there are four, but eventually they will have uh, as many as 12 potentials for you guys to copy here. Let's see what this individual's done. This is a medium risk. Let's go to Close Trades. He's made 866 trades so far. And we can go to the last page. So we can just see what he's done recently here. So today's the 25th. Let's see here, the 23rd, 22nd. So he has done quite a bit of trading here. Good stuff. And we can also take a look at where he actually stands right now. It's currently up 139.21%. Over the last week, he's made 1.28%. Last month, he had 17.57% gain. So definitely uh, somebody that you might want to look at following. Winning percent was 78% overall. Last week, 73%. Last year, 71.72%. You guys can definitely check all this information out on your own. Just uh, click the link below. Let's go back to the home page here. Or click on traders. And there are Brad, several others. I want you to uh, exit. You are AUD up here. Break even. Well, now he's you know, talking he's about Forex right he's now. Back out. No win, no loss. Get back out up here. Okay? You are AUD. Just exit the trade and go flat. Okay? Smooth Sterling. You guys got it? All right. This individual here, overall growth has been about 71.59%. Okay. 9.62% gain last month. Nice. Nice, Sean. 312 trades overall. Again, just click on that. All right, this right here is an hourly chart, like I said earlier, so I'm not going to sit and monitor that for now. And you can see some of the trades he's taken. He's actually trading 0 .01 lot sizes, so that's uh, pretty small. But we have some nice size winners here. Switching the focus only to futures, guys. Much, uh, the futures right now. much larger than our losers. You can see our winners do tend to be much larger, larger than our losers. We have a $0.31 cent loss, $2 loss. And you can see $9 win, $7 win, 10, 8, 11, 6, 4. So winners definitely tend to be much larger. 
I'm not going to go through all these. I just wanted you guys to see a few. And the low risk, this individual, he does not trade often. As you can see right here, so far he hasn't had a losing trade. And how long he's, has he been trading with the system? Let's see here. All time. All right, so he's only been with the company since November of last year. Oh, actually, it's uh, October 22nd, looks like. But we can go ahead and make sure by clicking on Close Trades. All right, so the first trade was here. So you guys can see that. So from October to February 19th. But again, extremely high win rate, 100%. You're not going to get trades every week, but this is more of the slow and steady wins the race type of uh, trader, it seems. Steady Freddy. So this is definitely somebody you guys might want to look at uh, uh, following, adding to your portfolio. All right, let's get back to it. Just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update on what's going on with the uh, trade copier service. And again, to check that out, just click on the link below. All right, it doesn't look like he's uh, doing any trading yet. Well, he's already done or started, but we've had such a heavy push down here that I'm not sure when we're going to uh, get another opportunity. So let me go ahead and pause it. We're already at six, well, basically seven minutes. And I'll come back once we get another opportunity. All right, folks, just uh, wanted to give you another update. This is somebody trading in the uh, Forex. Let me see here. I believe it was Kevin. I'm not sure what uh, currency pair he's actually in, but I've just clicked back over here and I saw them talking about Forex and it looks like he got stopped with a winner. His trailing stop got hit, but he took a nice winner apparently. Nice work, Kevin. Hang in there, Sean. So somebody's still in that trade. All right, so if you're in the Forex room or if you're uh, trading the Forex system, you probably know what they're talking about. All right, be back once we get a futures call. All right, 940 bucks for the day. I'm calling it good. So apparently Sean was able to make some money on whatever trade he was still in. 415 on sim, good practice, three points on the last one. All right, so as you guys can see, lots of people that are in the Forex trading or using the Forex trading software are making money. Futures is still just uh, doing what it's doing here. I think my screen is frozen. Let me pause and see what's going on. Hey folks, just another quick update here. Still waiting on uh, an opportunity on the ES. And honestly, just based on what I've seen, I'd be uh, perfectly happy if he decided to just stop after taking that uh, one winning trade. Just after seeing what I see here. All right, so I'll give it a little bit more time here. It's currently 10.06. They usually trade until 10.30. We'll see if things uh, even out here or give us an opportunity. And if they do, I'll be back. All right, guys, he just jumped in another trade here. Looks like he got in at 19.25. Order pending. See if I can jump in here. Order filled. <clears throat> We'll do one to one risk to reward on this one as well. Mm. 
Okay, so that should be here. That's one to one. Actually, he has his at 23 on the dot, so let me put mine here at 23 on the dot, and we'll push this up one tick as well. I'm not sure why, but for some reason my uh, screen here keeps freezing. As you can see, it's it's frozen right now. Hey guys, I'm just watching to see if this can uh, turn up one more time. A little bit aggressive down here, unfortunately. Took an earlier win, but we've had a couple of points worth of risk. Stop filled. All right, so it took a uh, loss here. All right, so yeah, it's uh, moving again now here. But this is important. I wanted you guys to actually see that he does show his uh, losing trades. He does show his losing trades in the rooms, as you guys just got to see. But yeah, just for me, just what I've been seeing in the market, I'm not necessarily... Uh, I'm not too excited about trading this just based on what I've seen here, but we can watch here so you guys can see him take some losers because I've gotten a few questions <clears throat> from people asking me if, you know, he shows the losing trades as well. And as you guys just saw, yes, he does show his losing trades. And if this one's a loser. You'll be able to see that as well.
I know this hasn't frozen again. Hold on one moment, guys. Let me get this back up. All right. Sorry about that, folks. Like I said, my uh, screen keeps freezing for some reason. Not sure what that's about, but he just Richie took off half. Okay, guys, we're going to go down to half again. Go down to half again. So now we got one, one, you got a half of one in the market. Got a half of a position in the market. That's it. You locked in all your money. Now let's wait. Now you're going to take your stop. You're going to rise it to 24.25, okay? 24.25 is your stop for your balance. Now you cannot lose a dime. You got money locked in. All right, and let's just see if this wants to go. wants to go higher, you're in it, okay? You're in it to win it. So you locked in some profits. Nice. Yep, you're sitting there going, hmm, this is good. Okay, hey guys, here's your stops. 26 is your stop, okay? 26 is your stop. Andre, where you been for the last 10 hours? Where you been, Andre, for the last 10 hours? Huh? Jeez. Whoa! Jeez! Where you been? Well, you've been since 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 2 o'clock in the morning. You just got up, woke up. <laughs> wow, what are you going to do, brother? What are you going to do? I hear, I hear, whoa, geez, got kids running their, uh, their London session, their new London session. Oh, I'm so embarrassed for them. God, I'm so embarrassed for them. Embarrassed. An embarrassment. Whoa, jeez. <laughs> oh, my, an embarrassment. Yeah, yeah, we got the London session, man. All right, so guys, raise your stops. To 27.25 on the futures. Raise the stops. 27.25. Raise those stops to 28. There we go. We're out. We're out of the game. All right. Let's see. How do we do today? How do we do today? 
How do we do today? How do we do today? Wow, four hundred forty-seven All right, folks, as you guys can see here, today we had uh, two winning trades, one losing trade. You got to see the vendor take that loss. So like I said, they do show losers in the trade room. You know, nothing is hitting. Everything is completely transparent. You know, as I've said um, on the site, you know, we do get to watch him trade live. So it's not like he can, after the fact, you know, remove losses. Everybody gets to see the trades as they're taken, folks. And I'm going to have to figure out what's going on with my uh, computer, why everything uh, freezes up on me here. But I'll worry about that another day. Today, at least you guys got to see everything that happened in the trade room. That was uh, my main objective here. Also, tomorrow is Friday. I'm not going to be able to uh, record anything. I do have an appointment tomorrow morning, so I'm not going to be able to uh, be in the room for tomorrow's session. But for those of you guys that have already joined up, congratulations. Hopefully you were able to make us some good money today. And I've gotten also quite a few emails about the sign-up process. I just want to pull this up real quick here. I'm going to mute this. Pretty much done with the recording here. And I'm pretty sure they're done for the day. It's already 10:23, 10:24. All right. So when you come to the actual website here, you're just going to go to uh, opportunity, click on platinum package, click on add to cart, and then you'll just click on add to cart a second time. And that's going to take you to the actual sign up page where you put all your information in let me remove some of my information here all right so as you can see obviously the first thing you want to make sure of is that Larry Lee is right there as your enrolling sponsor that is me and then pretty much all this information is self-explanatory you know, enter a username, password, first name, last name, answer to your security question, date of birth, email address, um, physical address information here. All of this, like I said, is self-explanatory. Same as physical address, affiliate information. You're just going to want to leave that as English, leave that as U.S. dollar if you're, uh, that's what your default language and currency is. Replicating website, this is just where you can choose your own. Like mine is ambition.imarketslive. You know, yours can be whatever you want it to be. Okay, so if your name is John Smith, you can choose John Smith. So johnsmith.imarketslive.com, you know, simple as that. Under a commission payment method, leave it as Paylution. All right. And then the next thing you're going to do is just uh, click here, 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 and here. 
and then put in your number there and that's pretty much it that'll take you to the next section where you'll put in your uh, payment information credit card information and you'll just go from there it's not a uh, not difficult at all folks so if you have any questions on this definitely just shoot me an email or you can visit me at empireambition.com and I help you out in any way I can all right that's going to be it for this video and I will uh, see you guys hopefully next week where we can uh, get a few more going take care